Have you ever thought about setting up your own browser cluster? It can get extremely complicated, and scheduling these browser instances takes not only lots of time, but also requires advanced technical skills. To make things worse, your personal server might struggle to keep up, with CPU and memory usage often maxing out, slowing down your tasks. But the most critical issue is the inability to run large-scale browser automation tasks. When you need to handle a large volume of tasks at once, it becomes nearly impossible. How can we get far away from these problems? Congratulations! One of our powerful solutions, Browserless, has been online. So, in this video, we're diving into Browserless. Let's see how it simplifies our tasks. The first topic needed to talk about is what is Browserless? Browserless is a cloud-based solution engineered for scalable browser automation, web scraping, and web testing. It leverages NS Browser's advanced fingerprint library, allowing random fingerprint switching for secure and efficient data collection. With Browserless, you can easily access and manage multiple browser instances, simplifying complex tasks and ensuring seamless performance in the cloud. And you can see the container of Browserless. All your automation scripts can be run and managed on our cloud service. You don't need to install and configure extra apps. Browserless also supports a high processing power for your multiple concurrent tasks. It is a wonderful technology to improve your efficiency and system performance. Browserless has extensive compatibility. You can use libraries like Puppeteer and Playwright that means you don't have to search for full support of any automation library. And the second aspect you may concern, and we also want to talk about, is the advantages of Browserless. Here we want to share two crucial ones. The first, and also the most important one, is Browserless can separate your web scraping work from your local device. It can really help avoid high demands of your core infrastructure. You can run any scripts and executing complex tasks in a headless Chrome. Our cloud services will operate all your large-scale concurrent tasks. That means, in case one of the processes goes down, it will not affect the other ones. I know you absolutely don't want and receive these to happen. Yes, I mean, it's an ideal choice to use Browserless to get rid of these dreadful catastrophes. The second one you must like is Browserless Ensure Session Continuity. With Keep Alive, you can switch between different browser sessions seamlessly. And, you know, Browserless also supports persistent caching and cookie management, which can maintain data consistency across multiple sessions. Remember the problems we mentioned earlier with using a local browser to configure a cluster? With Browserless, all of these challenges are solved. No more complex configurations, and handling large-scale tasks becomes effortless. Browserless leverages the cloud, allocating resources on demand, removing the limitations of local hardware, and making large-scale task handling easy. No complex setup is required. With just a few lines of code, you can start automating tasks more efficiently and conveniently. Now I think the best thing to help you know more details about how does Browserless work is show you guys a sample. As an example, we will write a screenshot service that takes a picture of the website and downloads it. The first step we need to do is generate API key. To get the API key, you can choose to go to this browser client dashes API menu, or just click the API key in the browserless section. Okay, now we need to install Puppeteer Core. Now you don't have to worry about bundling Chrome or its dependencies in production and can continue to develop your application. Just as I said before, all your tasks will run on the cloud. So, happy scraping! Let begin scraping with Browserless using Puppeteer. Here we have to configure Puppeteer with Browserless at the very beginning. Puppeteer is fairly active and has many maintainers. So it's one of the highest quality libraries around. Then, copy the PNPM core and it will be generated here. Okay, now import our project into Terminal, finish your express here, and paste the API key. The other elements just fill them as you need. Yes, this is the latest line we need to conduct, which will show us the ending image output. Here is a sample curl call that will use your new service to ensure it's all working. 
You can also just open the output in your local browser absolutely. By the way, you can view the statistics of recent requests and the remaining session time in the browserless menu of the browser client. All the detailed information, like running requests, successful or rejected requests, and so on. Always notice your data, please. Well, guys, these are all contents of this video. All the materials are prepared in the video description. As you can see, Browserless is a game changer for developers looking to simplify their browser automation and web scraping tasks, ready to get started. Visit nstbrowser.io or go to our Browserless doc to explore how it can transform your projects today. Thanks for watching.